using a ceiling lift to place the transfer sling under a lying resident. It can be physically challenging to place a transfer sling under a resident who is lying in bed and requires more than minimal assistance to turn in bed. Using a ceiling lift to turn the resident in bed will enable the caregiver to place the transfer sling under the resident with very little physical exertion, therefore minimize the risk of musculoskeletal injury for the caregiver. It is standard practice that a resident who requires more than minimal assistance to move in bed is lying on a positioning sling unless contraindicated. Retrieve the ceiling lift and carry bar from the docking station and lower the lift's carry bar to a comfortable height. Quickly check the lift for any visible damage. For example, is the black belt attached to the carry bar frayed? Is the black belt twisted and requires straightening? Is the handset functioning properly? Is the motor battery sufficiently charged? Move the lift over the resident's legs. Quickly check the sling for any visible damage. For example, are the sling straps and loops frayed or torn? Is the body of the sling in good condition? Ensure the lift's carry bar is positioned lengthwise or parallel to the resident's body. Raise the height of the bed to a comfortable working height. If the bed rails are up, lower the bed rails on one side and connect the positioning sling strap on this side at the resident's upper chest shoulder level. Ensure that there is a pillow under the resident's head. Press the handset up button and start raising the carry bar. Cross the resident's legs to assist with the turn. Stop when the resident is lying on the side. Place the transfer sling on top of the bed. Ensure that the sling label and handles are facing the mattress. Align the sling so that the resident's spine is in line with the center of the transfer sling and that the bottom edge of the transfer sling is just slightly above the resident's coccyx. Roll half of the sling and tuck it underneath the resident. Lower the carry bar and disconnect the positioning sling strap. Ensuring that the sling straps are covered by the sling fabric to prevent rubbing against the resident's skin Roll the positioning sling as far under the resident as you can safely do. Raise the bed rail on the side where the sling has been disconnected and rolled under the resident. Connect the other side of the positioning sling to the carry bar at shoulder level. Raise the lift's carry bar. The resident will start to turn towards the side of the disconnected sling. Stop when you notice that the positioning sling is starting to slide under the resident. Starting from the resident's head, gently pull the positioning sling from under the resident. If you have to pull too hard, slightly raise the lift's carry bar to assist with this process. Once the positioning sling has been completely removed from under the resident, move the carry bar to the foot of the bed. Remove the positioning sling from the carry bar. If you want to transfer the resident out of the bed, slide the transfer sling's leg flaps under the resident's thighs. Move the lift carry bar over the resident's stomach. Ensure that the carry bar is aligned parallel to the resident's shoulders and start connecting the transfer sling to the carry bar.